What does SMS stand for? C. Short messaging service. Which technology is used for sending and receiving data over cellular networks? C. 3G, 4G, 5G. What does LTE stand for? A. Long-term evolution. Which mobile technology allows for mobile payments using NFC? C. NFC. What is the protocol used for sending and receiving emails on mobile devices? A. SMTP. Which technology allows mobile phones to connect to the internet without Wi-Fi? A. 3G. Which technology is used for determining the location of a mobile device? A. GPS. What is the standard connector used for charging mobile devices? A. Micro USB. Which technology allows for wireless communication between devices over short distances? B. Bluetooth. What is the term for the process of transforming voice and video into digital data for transmission over mobile networks? C. Encoding. What component of a mobile phone is responsible for storing data and files? C. Storage. Which component of a mobile phone is used for displaying images and videos? B. Screen. What is the main function of the processor in a mobile phone? B. Run apps and processes. Which component of a mobile phone is responsible for capturing photos and videos? C. Camera. Which component of a mobile phone provides power to the device? B. Battery. What is the purpose of the SIM card in a mobile phone? C. Activate the phone. Which component of a mobile phone is responsible for providing sound output? B. Speaker. What component of a mobile phone is used for connecting to mobile networks? B. Antenna. Which component of a mobile phone is used for sensing touch input? C. Touch sensor. What component of a mobile phone allows for making phone calls? B. SIM card. What component of a mobile phone is used to connect to the Internet? A. Wi-Fi module. What component of a mobile phone is used to charge the device? A. Charger port. Which component of a mobile phone is responsible for detecting the phone's orientation? A. Accelerometer. What component of a mobile phone is used to receive cellular signals? B. Antenna.